All right, welcome everybody to another episode of Far Cry 5. Last episode, we uh, finished Faith's region, and today we're going to be starting on the third and final region of the of the map. Um, I believe the brother's name was Jacob. So uh, that's what we're going to start with today. We're going to be moving into a new region and starting the story. I'm excited to see where this is going to go. The last one was pretty trippy with all the uh, bliss. It was, uh, it was quite an interesting region, so I'm excited to see where this one goes. But uh, first things first is I do need to uh, rearm my my guns and everything got wicked weird in this uh, at the end of the game there I was uh, picking up some of the enemy's weapons. Hey, if you're near a shop, you might want to pop in. There's some new toys you might want to play with. Uh, but I hope everybody's having a great night. And I appreciate you all for coming and hanging out on the live. Face gone. All right, so really quick, let me see here. Let's start off here. Yeah, we do have access to quite a few guns now. So I got this. Uh, this is the gun I've been using since the beginning of the game. Literally, you start off with the 1911. Um, but I was trying to see if there was anything else that's... that's what ba What's the base damage on it? Five. That's seven, three... That's the yeah, 44 mag hits hard. Maybe I'll try this sixer, uh, the revolver, or something that just hits really hard at close range because I don't need, I don't know. I don't know, chat. I don't know. Let me get my, uh, What AK was I using? Okay, so that one is the same. I think this is the one. Yeah, this is the one we had dressed up. Okay. So we'll go ahead and get this equipped. This is our first. <clears throat> it's the SA 50. So I think I already. The one I have currently, which is. One of the featured guns, I believe. Yeah, this one. So this is the SA-50. We'll go ahead and get this one equipped. Uh, Double Nine, how you doing? Nin, how you doing? No, no, no. This, I, I tried to tell you this, this, this before, chat. I'm not late, okay? Okay? Um, I always... Uh, I'll have the, the stream set uh, for like six, and then I always give people a couple minutes to come in. Uh... Because people literally will start showing up at 6, in between 6 and 6.05, and then that's when I usually get it started. Uh, gives me a couple minutes to, you know, make sure all my stuff's squared away. Okay, so we're running Sniper. I think I'm going to swap over to a launcher, maybe? And we'll use that. All right, so we're dressed to impress, champ. There it is. Could throw a scope on there too, but we'll roll with that. All right, let's restock. Get some body armor, med kits. All right, we're good to go, Jet. All right, chat. So we are going to head up, like I said, to this new region, Jacob's region. And his first mission, I believe, is... Jess. Jess Black. Find me at the lumber mill. The cook's days are fucking numbered. What's my favorite game? My favorite game of all time is Red Dead Redemption 2. One of the greatest games ever created. Um, there it is. Nothing like punching a vehicle. Okay, so 
All of our guns are good. Everything is good to go. Let's head out. Wildlands? Wildlands is a good game. Yeah, we had a lot of fun with that on the channel. Yeah, I had somebody in the comments, uh... I don't know if it was last episode or maybe my second episode. Might even been the first episode, champ. I'm, I'm not sure, but somebody was in the comments. I literally just read it earlier, and it made me laugh <laughs> when I seen it. But all the comments said was they were just like, you're so bad at games. And I was just like, yeah, I never claimed to be good. So, like, what are you, what are you getting at, dude? <laughs> you, you always hear that a lot. You know, I, I get that a lot. People tell me I'm like, I'm terrible at games, or I suck at said game, or whatever game it is. And... I would understand, you know, their argument if I was claiming to be the best. But I've never once. I don't even say I'm the best at State of the Cage yet. I mean, have you guys, out of a joking manner, you know what I mean? I might joke around and say stuff, but have any of you guys ever heard me say or claim to be the best at anything? I feel like being the best is, it's, it's hard, man. It's too much to live up to. You know what I mean? I like to, I like to keep the bar real low, chat. <laughs> I like to keep the bar real low. Why did I stop playing Breakpoint? We beat it, Darren. Yeah, we beat it. I mean, I, I could probably claim that, you know, I'm probably the best driver of all time and non-dog shooter of all time. There is certain things that I probably could actually claim now that you guys mention it. Because, you know, I, I guess I am the greatest of all time when it comes to that stuff. I take it back, chat. I am the greatest. There it is. Okay. Okay, we're going to have to... Uh, No, I take it back, chat. Greatest of all time. <laughs> the greatest dog killer in the... <laughs> Lies. I'm the greatest non-dog killer of all time. Damn, how did they get him up there, chat? That's impressive. Savage, but impressive. All right, so we got to liberate the lumber mill here. All right. I'd like to take these alarms out. And then we can then we can go to work chat. I actually only see one alarm. So we got a bunch of dudes up top here. I'm going to deal with the sniper. Got an armored good right there.
Literally, I hit this freaking little, uh, I had this little jelly band on my thing, and my freaking mouse kept hitting. I'm like, what the hell is this? There we go. So we got those guys. They're going to be moving up to where we were. Alright, so let me nail the sniper really quick. Did that go through his head and hit the can? And explode? <laughs> it sounded like it almost went through his head and blew something up, chat. So Jess, she's the. Uh, was she the cool-looking chick with the freaking bow and arrow? Yep, definitely was. Okay, so we got the lumber mill key. I don't know what that opens. Wasn't creepy at all. Yeah, Jess seems like she's about to be a really nice person. Where the hell did you come from? Thanks for busting me out. Name's Jess. If you're out here picking fights with the cult, then I'm guessing you already know my uncle Dutch. Look, I don't got a lot of time to waste. I'm gonna get right to the point. Oh, this is Dutch's on the trail niece. Of one of Jacob's zealots. Goes by the name the Cook. Yeah, don't sound so scary. But believe me, he's one twisted fuck. 
almost tracked him down. But a Peggy patrol got the drop on me. I need your help. We can't let this trail go cold. If you're looking to hook up with the Whitetails, this could be your way in. And more importantly, I need help put an evil motherfucker in the grave. Gotta move. Wasted too much time already. Follow me. The Whitetails, chat. I mean, so far she's cool. his calling card that's why they call him the cook burned alive it all makes sense now chat you're gonna slow walk this whole time scribing everyone they'll take you from your home the bar even church don't matter where you are then they slot you into one of two categories weak or strong see jacob's building an army and anyone who can't or won't fight for him winds up dead. Cull in the herd, he calls it. Wholesale slaughter innocent people. Nobody believed it was happening because nobody wanted to believe. Now you can do these territories in any order, right, Jap? That doesn't necessarily mean this that this this one that we're doing now is uh Inherently more difficult. Oh, she's a monster, chat. Yeah, you can. That's what I thought. So, is this by any means the hardest region? Because in my brain, I forgot that you could play them in any in any order. So I was like, oh, this is this is going to be the last and final. The hardest region, you know what I mean? Then there's the one we're after. The cook. He's one of Jacob's favorites. The one who but now I kind of feel like this was supposed to be the first region you were supposed to do. This motherfucker's gonna get what he deserves. Because I think you actually start in this region, don't you? All about the same. Let's have a look. Careful. Stay low. Shit, I don't see me treat the people like fucking animals. Keeping them in cages. Okay, let's do this. But keep your head down. They spot us, those hostages are dead. Okay. That was perfectly quiet. Always talking that shit, chat. What a bunch of assholes. How's she gonna say, oh, I guess perfect or quiet? That was that was quiet, chat. Do that. But there were others. Hey, they picked them up the mountain. Hey, thought I was headed for a bunker. Thanks, deputy. There's more of us. The the cook. He picked them up the mountain. Please. What the hell? No! Thank you so much. Watch my shit. Yeah, go the for cook. it. He, he took others. Took them up the mountain. No. no. You want to know why they call him the cook? Wait, we saved these people. What are you doing? Why are you killing them? One of his guys out to round up this family. Gonna make you so Parents and kids. First thing he did was starve them. Gave them nothing. Not even a drop of water. After three days, they got She's a savage, chat. Their own pit. But the kids didn't want to do it. 
So the parents forced it down their throats. Kids puked it right back up. Cook didn't like that. I didn't do anything. I she just so killed all those people. Posts under the hot sun. I kicked the last one in the face. That doesn't mean that she murders them all in cold blood with a bow and arrow. Hold up. I think I heard something. Well, good thing I'm a straight up ninja. That's one. Ooh. talking about lady this lady literally does not know what the hell she's talking about chat well I'll try that again like that was the actual definition of not going loud <laughs> she's trolling me All right, let me not kick anybody in the face accidentally because this lady murders people. Thank you. Oh, God. The cook took the rest of the pit. Thank you. Let's go. You're the one that's gone to poke the hornet's nest, aren't you? Hey, over here. So the cook... He had the parents on posts and decided to give the kids a little water. And then he asked if they were hungry. The kids were starving, so they said yes. Started begging for food. The cook asked if they want pork. The kids said yes. So he went out to the parents and took their shoes off and started to play. This little piggy went to market. And the blood poured like a damned faucet. That's disgusting. A big old grin on his face as he offered each little piece to the kids. That's that's pretty savage, Chad. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie, that's Like, you gotta be a really messed up person to feed kids their own parents. Pretty soon there were no more piggies left. Constantino's day is going great. So he laughed and set the parents on fire. And the air filled up with that sickly sweet smell of roasting flesh. I'll never forget that smell. When they finally stopped screaming, I looked around, and he was just... gone. Vanished like some sort of demon in the night. Anyways, that's why they call him the cook. Burning him. 
That's a better death than that piece of shit deserved. We took him out. I feel numb. That was right. Cook's dead, and I don't feel anything. All I ever wanted was to find this guy, and now I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. That's just been right about a lot of shit lately. Colt, Eli, maybe he's right about you too. You, uh, need someone to watch your back? Call me. And, uh, thanks. Oh, nice. So she, we unlocked her as a companion? Wait. Damn. There was a lot of progress to that first, towards the first area there. Oh, you know what it is, a chat. It's a good uh it's a good way to start the day, a little bit of clutch Nixon. Hey deputy, that needs of mine. She don't make friends easy, but if you want things done quickly and quietly, she's your girl. Keep her safe for me, okay? Use these damn perks. So let me see here. Two, and then I want to get help out with my sniping. Unlock the very last perk. What is the very last perk? Um. Leadership unlock. Oh, it allows me to carry two people at once. Okay. Yeah, we can work towards that. I wanted. To, I, I I knew I wanted to get the increased health, and I knew I wanted to get uh, the stuff to help me out with my long range shooting. But That's what I'm here for. But now it's time to go clutch Nixon mode. April 15th, 1968. Clutch Nixon, the greatest stuntman on planet Earth, drove an all-terrain vehicle through woodlands as unbreakable as the man himself. The oh, this is gonna suck, chat. As the moose knuckle run, named after a Wenja ritual involving Wenja. ice bags mixed with semen extracted from the large beasts. It was believed to enhance one's stamina, endurance, and virility. Although the ritual has since been debunked by modern science, no one has ever managed to repeat Hush's feat. Uh, Constantino's asked, uh, why every time you get over a thousand likes on oh uh, casinos i don't i don't have any games i'm playing currently that get any less than like five or six hundred likes uh but art gets a lot because it's just a um pretty popular game on the channel but pretty much everything we play gets at least 500 plus for the most part 
grip on the wheel on those wooden ramps. And they did it. I don't think I've played, I don't think I've gotten 200 likes only on something in a, it's been a long time. Whoa there, Sway. I would I, I would stop playing a game at that point. What's the music, chat? Where's the clutch Nixon music? Did I turn the music off? It's not the same. I'm, I'm gonna have to restart, chat. We gotta, we gotta restart, chat. I can't do a clutch Nixon music uh, thing without clutch, clutch, uh, clutch Nixon. Like, it just feels weird. There it is. Yeah, we played Far Cry Primal. But yeah, I think the division is doing better than uh, Ark on the channel. Division's actually like I think the most popular game we're playing at the moment. Of a bitch. Go. An incredible leap by our driver. Yeah, this one was pretty easy, chat. For the most part. There it is, chat. Clutch Nixon. The Moose Knuckle Run. The Moose Knuckle Run. Oh yeah, those drug trucks, I never finished that. Let's head back to here. So do I, uh, none of his story missions popped up yet. I wonder if I just have to go around and... Well, we could get Herc too, chat.
Yeah, yeah let's get a car. Uh, is there a garage here? I don't believe there's a garage here. We we'll take this. Okay. We're real scared, chat. So let's get, uh... Let's get the cougar. And let's go look at getting Herc, maybe. Hey, Migos, it's me. What? The raid? Don't sound too good. I wish it popped up and told me... Being hunted, chat. Who raided? Oh, raid in game. Got you. Dude, set my ass on fire in the car. I just hit the... Don't hit buffaloes in the game, chat. You shouldn't come for me. Should have run. The world is weak. Soft. We have forgotten what it is to be strong. You know, our heroes used to be gods. And now our heroes are godless, weak, feeble, diseased. We let the weak dictate to the powerful, and then we are shocked to find ourselves adrift. But history knows the value of sacrifice, of culling the herd so that it stays strong. Over and over, the lives of the many have outweighed the lives of the few. This is how we survived, and we forgot her. And now, the bill has come due. So Jacob was part of the 82nd? Now, the collapse is upon us. And this time, the lives of the few outweigh the lives of the many. And when Airborne. a nation has never hunger, desperation descends into madness. We'll be ready. We will call the herd. We will do what needs to be done.
No, nah, it's not special forces. It's just the army's uh, airborne unit. Um. Call the herd. Excellent. Good. 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 Call the herd. Keep moving. What is the next arc map? I have I have no clue. Make your sacrifice. Sir. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Give me a hand, kid. <laughs> Eli, is this. Yep. What the fuck is the deputy doing here? Jacob took a shine to him, same as us. You're gonna be okay, hero. White Tail's got you now. <laughs> We're bringing him back to the wolf's den? Where else? Tammy's not gonna like this. Don't worry about Tammy, she'll be fine. Mind? Now hold on, Weedy and I agree. Oh, you agree? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Why was it best an impartial observer? This is stupid, and this is dangerous. You both know better. What was I supposed to do? Leave him to die. Tammy. They've been in that room for God knows how long. I've seen what it does to people. You haven't. You can't trust this one. That's what everyone said about you. But luckily, I didn't listen. This is not up for discussion. We need him. That's all there is to it. Understand? T Tammy's a savage, Chet. You're right. She took that real well. Out. Man, he didn't do anything. I meant what I said. We need you. Let's get you some rest. Hey, dude. The world is weak. Me, uh, rearm. Sell this crap. 
We'll keep our current guns. I, I like the, the setup we have currently. Man, you look like shit. Good to see you standing. We're still doing our thing down here. Keep in touch. Your guns are best friends. So I guess doing this area first would make more sense because you you go directly from working there with Dutch are. to working with Dutch's like people, I guess. They're trying to track you down, deputy. Dutch speaks highly. Look, I'll get right to it. I know what you did down south. You got the father thinking twice now, and that's good for us. We're bleeding bodies up here. No two ways about it. I don't know if we'll be able to hold out more than a week at this rate. Times are desperate, to say the least. I'm trying to get some footholds back, so I sent a handful of whitetails out to sabotage the visitor center. Invisibility! Oh, for that bliss shit. But our guys walked right into a fucking trap. They've been taken hostage and we're up against the clock. If I just send another group in there, we risk losing everything. But you, you're something that cult ain't expecting. You're the only one I got around here who can handle this, Step. Only one I trust to handle this. I'm counting on you. You'll need to go in quiet. Cult gets windier around, they're liable to kill our people. There's a bow on the table if you need it. Huh. Get our people back, Deb. Quiet's what I Good do, luck. brother. He, mu he must not know, chat. Now look at me. Might have come across a little harsh earlier. I ain't apologizing. I'm just acknowledging. I don't trust people I don't know. But Eli says you're all right, so I gotta go with that until I see otherwise. You prove your worth, and you and I will get along just fine. Here's the deal. Weedy's trying to get a pirate radio station up and running. He told Eli it's to help coordinate the militia, but I'm pretty sure he just wants to play his own music. So we're gonna indulge him. Problem is, he can't get a signal out. Our friend here said the cult's been jamming this whole area. Also told us how. Seems there's two radio towers with jammers on them and a third on a mobile unit patrolling the roads. Take the towers out first. That ought to clear the signal enough for me to locate the patrol. I'll let you know when I find it. Can never have Do this, and maybe we can start building some of that trust up. Bow hunting is the best hunting. You're not lying, dude. Bow hunting is the best hunting. Appreciate it, Dutch. Okay, so the visitor center is actually really, really close by. More clutch up there. We got Weedy here. It was a third mission for us. Good to have you on our side, Dad. Hey, got a sec? Whitetail Militia has been ready for this fight for years. Eli made sure we had caches stashed all over the place. Guns, ammo, you name it. Gotta be prepared for anything, you know? But the way things are going, we need those supplies here. Not sitting in some bunker waiting to be found. Last thing we need are the fucking Peggy stumbling across our shit. So if you could get those supplies, it'd be a big help for us. But, uh, there is one problem. We don't keep a map of the caches here. Don't ask me why. Safeguards, or some bullshit. There's a scout up at the Jefferson Lookout Tower who should have one. Place is just west of here. Good luck and be careful out there. Being a prepper ain't just about you, brother. Stuff. It's about having the knowledge. All right, so yeah, both of these missions are relatively close by. We'll start with this one. So I've rethunk my uh, my strat there. 
This, this region's probably not the easiest one to navigate, especially at night. So let's go ahead and grab our chopper. Now we gotta definitely land off because they said if we uh, get spotted, the people could get killed. So we wanna definitely make sure that doesn't happen. Look like there's too many baddies here anyways. <laughs> Got guys inside too. Crazy setup they have at the wolf's den, huh? Please. My life flashed through my eyes there. Wish Emily you saved our guys at Devil Drop. Please. Please. I owe you more than you can imagine. Guess they spotted one of the bodies that I dropped. White tails at Hawkeye Tunnel. Fuck. Yep, they took two of our people up to Devil's Drop. Jacob's on the warpath trying to find a wolf's den. If the Peggy's find us, we don't stand a chance. But if our guys don't give up the location, they'll be tossed off that cliff. All last, Depp. Devil's drops to the south of you. There's a ton of judges in these woods. If Bo's not careful, he's gonna be caught. Have I ever played he's Primal Fear? No, I've never heard of that, Constantinos. We need a... Open World Metal Gear Solid game. I was, gonna say, I was gonna say, wasn't Metal Gear Solid 5 open world? We gotta finish that game on the channel one of these days, chat. Metal Gear Solid 5 Phantom Pain, I only did like, a couple streams of it, we didn't make it super far in the game.
you crazy, take the front. If you're smart, head up top. Now we're crazy, chap. Got it. Everyone's accounted for. That's the white tail way down. Helping us take care of our own is gonna have a big impact on morale. On, Maybe even get some more folks to join up too. Shit. And I knew Tammy was wrong about you. Congratulations. You're one of us now. If you got time, I got more work. Come see me in the wool stand when you're ready. Outstanding work, Deb. <laughs> We're gonna take this goddamn mountain back from Jacob. I know it. We already got the RPG. From the cult. They're calling in chopper convoys to patrol for whitetails. Keep your head on a swivel and an eye to the sky. Yeah, this region is definitely easier, chat. Um, you see how fast we're making it through the uh the bar? Uh I would say out of all of them, Faith's region was probably the hardest when it came to actually macking out maxing out the resistance. Hmm. We got all these missions right here. We'll knock these out. And uh, thank you guys again. Already almost 270 likes on the stream. I really appreciate it. You have that motorcycle of uh, the game in real life? That's dope. I've actually never owned a motorcycle. You hear me? It's Weedy. If you're getting close to that tower, grab the map. No baddies? Chairs. Last thing we need is to lose you again. 
Not gonna happen, brother. Nab me once. Shame on me. You ain't gonna nab me again. Alright, so there's the two caches. What is this? There's the tower. We'll knock this out too over here. Nelly, with the super chat, thank you so much for dropping by to wish uh, the best Far Cry player ever. <laughs> I don't know about all that, Nels. Uh, have a great streamer. I appreciate you, Nels. Now. Hope you're having a great night. Only if Bad Wolf says I'm the best Far Cry player ever. And the best non-dog killer. Right, Bad Wolf? The best non-dog killer ever? Say it. You know you want to say it. Could I just shoot this from the ground? Think so. Hope you don't get vertigo. Yeah. That'll do it. Next tower's northeast. It's on a cliff overlooking the hotel. If you got a wingsuit, now's the time to use it. Just try not to crash. I mean, I'd rather not do that because I got my helicopter over here, lady. Wherever the hell that is. Oh, uh, we landed over. Um, so if I jump down, I should be able to just activate my parachute, right? Yep. We oh, gotta hold it. You gotta hold it! <laughs> Let's say I should be able to just activate a la parachute. Dang, chat, you see, Bad Wolf won't even give us... You want to give it to us, chat. There's at least one more guy here somewhere. Right over here. It was a pig or a dog? What was that?
was talking a lot of shit, man. Up the jammer. Got it. This one has baddies though. Oh, What's up, bud? Cats got him. This thing was leaking. I don't know if that's enough to blow it up, though. I'm used to the division, you hit the tank, the fire comes out and it blows up. No, he's still alive. Here it is, chat. We got it. You guys see how much we got? It. How does chat always got it? Why you guys got to notice everything? All right, I didn't kill that cat. All right, the the exploding tank killed that cat. But of course, no death of any animal will ever go. It will never uh, not be noticed by chat. That notices every death. Nah, he was dead dead. The flame thing exploded and killed him. So now he's temporarily unavailable. I should be able to just do this with the helo, right chat? Clean. All clear. Weed is gonna be happy. Can't say the same for people who don't share his taste in music. Maybe we can work on this whole trust thing after all. Got more work for you back at the wolf stand if you're looking to keep busy. See you around. Didn't even need to ambush though, chat. That was a uh... Troy Jacobs helicopters. It's pretty easy to pull off with uh No, I'll refill my rockets. I generally don't do it because it's so expensive. Yeah, Yubi does like their animals. And I love animals, too. A 
lions and tigers and bears and sharks and dogs and cats and birds, turtles, rabbits. Love them all, Chip. Put some work in on my chopper there somehow. Okay, so we got two caches here that we got to hit really quick. If I'd have known that, I would not have wasted my thousand on this damn chopper. I do got my repair tool though, so when we land, I'll, I'll, I'll fix it up. No, I just like animals, Chet. I'm an animal lover. I am. I'm sorry. I, I'll admit it. I, you know, I don't mind coming and telling you guys. No shame in it. I'm an animal lover. repair really quick so we don't have to listen to this damn alarm. There it is. Should be good. God, with the two months, man. Thank you so much. How you doing tonight? You get the auto repair perk. You won't have to use your repair torch. Well, then what the hell's the point of the repair torch? Nah, check around. Cabin's too obvious. What about a root cellar? Or something that would lead underground? Root cellar, something that would lead underground. Yeah, I guess uh, the auto repair wouldn't work on... Uh I don't know what a root cellar is. I'm not... I'm not about that life, dude. I know what a normal basement is. Is it inside, maybe? The way he's talking about it, I was looking for, like, a freaking tornado tower thing. Nah, check around. Cabin's too obvious. What about a root cellar? 
think I got lock picking, didn't I? Yep. A root setter sellers a basement for food. Found it yet? Relax, dude. Cash has a tracker that'll cause a feedback loop on your radio if you get close. They probably hid it underground. Definitely wouldn't keep it in the cabins. Yeah, but there was a safe in the cabin. There we go. Like this? Voila! That was not a dog, that was a wolf. Like a legitimate wolf. Look at that. my chopper go is some no really chat sometimes the AI gets you in your chopper and literally just takes your shit The same team, asshole. What the? Hey, I got you on camera. Wait. Ah, oh, no! Those motherfuckers looted the place. 
They're driving away with our shit! Get after them and get that stash back! Hurry! They're getting away! <laughs> That was just a warm up chat. That was just a warm up. Hey, I got you on camera. Wait. Ah, oh, no! Those motherfuckers looted the place. They're driving away with our shit. Get after them and get that stash back. Hurry! They're getting away! Well, now we know why it's called the the gray wolves den, right, chat? There's freaking wolves everywhere here. No, yeah, I'm not on hard. I think I'm playing. I'm just playing on like normal, the normal mode. can actually put this stuff to use instead of letting it collect dust in some bunker. This is a big help. I can't believe you caught those guys. Thought for sure they'd get away. If we had a couple more people like you around here, Eden's Gate would have rolled over a long time ago. Thanks again, Deputy. Ain't no problem, bro. Good to see you, Dep. Got a job for you. You remember the Grand View Hotel? That shithole we pulled you out of? Need you to head back there. Jacob nabbed a whitetail by the name of Briggs, and he's using the same brain melting nonsense he tried on you. All in the hopes that Briggs will give up the wolf stand. I don't think our boy can hold out as long as you did. And if he gives up our location, we're done. So we gotta move on this quick. Some folks here think the smart move would be just to off him. But if we start killing our own to save our asses, how's that make us any better than Jacob? Nah, I ain't going down that road. Here's what we're gonna do instead. Weedy's cooked up a little deprogramming package. Same thing we used on you. Need you to swap out the tape they got running in Briggs' room with the one I'm gonna give you. And then, well, then we'll see what happens. If everything goes smooth, our guy comes back to Earth. If it doesn't, We'll deal with that when the time comes. Savage. Uh, Golden Eye comes on Game Pass this week. Now I'm just wondering, Battle, if it's gonna if it's gonna be available on the Windows Store, like if I'll be able to play it on PC. From what I've seen, it said Xbox only. And uh, and as you guys know, I don't I don't own an Xbox. Wasn't sure you'd come back, but I guess you're full of surprises. This squealer here ran security up at the chalet. 
Lucky for us, he wasn't that good at his job and wound up in my kiddie pool. Seems the place is being used as a training ground for the Chosen. If you've seen them in action, you know how ruthless they are. You know what Jacob taught him to use for target practice? Live bodies. Savage. Gets their first kill jitters out of the way. These motherfuckers don't value any life that ain't in their cult. And they need to be put down like the dogs they are. So you're gonna head up to that chalet. You're gonna kill every chosen you see, and you're gonna rig that building with explosives. And then we're gonna watch that whole fucking place turn into a smoldering heap of ash. Sound good to you? Yes, actually. It sounds like a really good plan. Get on board with that. There it is. Oh, let me see. Refill. Ammo's all good. So I was trying to do more shooting. At closer ranges. And those last couple, just to just to change things up. I I, I, I keep doing sniping. So I wanted to do a little close range. not gonna be in the fucking sky, bro. Eyes open. There's choppers in the area. No, there, there, no. Our, this is gonna be the last stream of the night. I only do two streams a day, cause I, I gotta get, I gotta sleep. Believe it or not, I does sleep a little bit. This isn't as thick as I thought it was going to be. I expected to see way more dudes in this. Well, there's the hunters. They would 
be sickened, and they would be angry. We have forgotten where we came from. We have forgotten who we are. No longer. We will become killers. We will become tenacious. We will become... Tenacious D. Seen somebody said you can't avoid the hunters. We, we ki I killed them when they came after me. Killed the shit out of them, dudes. This chap. My chopper was over here. Yep, it's still there. It is, chap. Hey, Constantinos, get that good sleep, all right? And we took an arrow to the whole knee? 
What was that? One of you will be strong. Not again. Yeah, your pages. I know you are in pain. The Lord giveth and the Lord taketh, huh? You're not the only one to be tested. Did you know that I had a wife? So beautiful, isn't she? We were pregnant with our first child. And we were just babies ourselves, really. And I was terrified. I'm becoming a father, mostly about money. She wasn't worried. She had faith that things were gonna work out. She always had faith. gonna go visit a friend. Hmm. There was an accident. The Lord take it. They rushed him to a hospital and put me in a room with this little pink bundle stuffed with tubes. And they said that I had to be strong because my little girl was gonna live. God was looking out for our daughter. And they left me uh, alone in the room with her. I just stare at my daughter, so helpless, and so innocent. And all she had in the world was me, and nobody from nowhere with me. Fuck. And in that moment. I knew that God was testing me. He was laying out a path before me, and all I had to do was choose. So I put my hand on my little girl's head, and I leaned in and I could smell. And we prayed together, prayed for wisdom, prayed for strength. Call the herd.
done. Well done. Yes, sacrifice the weak. Kill! 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 Good. That shit was crazy, chat. Cause that man killed his baby, dude. Deputy, Zeli, just checking in. Nobody's seen you in a while. White tails could really use your help out there. Pop by the wolf stand if you get the chance. We got a lot of work to do. I didn't even get to finish the last bit of work because I got captured <laughs> again. Again, chat. <laughs> All right, so we got this location. We got to hit. Hold on, one. Give me one sec, guys. Give me one sec, chat. And thank you all for almost 400 likes, everybody. Alright, my bad. My bad. Oh. Alright, let's get to flying, chat. Let's get to flying. Is there anybody in chat that is from Montana?
It's actually one state on in America that if somebody gave me a blank map, I would probably only have about. I know it's on the like west side, western side of America, but I could not tell you where the hell Montana is in the country. Like, there's probably like a 40% chance I'd get it right. I know where Idaho is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kinda. It's, it's one of those weird northern western states. Right? So we got to do this sneaky like then? I mean, I don't mean no offense to anybody from over there, but I mean, let, let's be honest, chat. I feel like the northwestern, like, chunk of America, like, is it just me that doesn't really know the, like, I know Seattle or Wa Washington State, you know, Oregon, California, but then everything, like, over from there, Shit. I don't know. That's like a big unknown block of the country. <laughs> In my brain. Yeah, once you yeah, like the Midwest, like that whole that whole chunk of America. I could name every state in order on the East Coast. But yeah, as soon as you get to that that area over there, woo, it's it's tough, chat. I, mean, I could label like Arizona and Nebraska. So we just got to switch out the tape chat. So we're going to try to do this all sneaky like. man was draining the main vein, chat. Might pop one of those hunting potions. It'll give me the vision, chat. It'll give me the vision. Sword would lost so it would be found. 
I think that might be upstairs. I must be upstairs, son.
That was actually a pretty big raid right there, chat. Jacob won't be using a grand view to fuck with anyone now. God damn. I'd love to see his ugly mug when he hears he lost his <laughs> the own granny door landing. <laughs> I forgot about the different ammo types. That's been a long time coming. Yeah. A long time. Uh, for, like armor piercing rounds. We need it. We need to uh, try those out the next time we get hit with the uh, tanky dudes. Switch over to the armor tank and or the armor piercing. Yeah, I had I had a pretty good granny fall there. I was trying to leap down from the top floor and yeah, my dude didn't he wasn't about that that life. He he wasn't having it. Don't let your guard down even for a second. All right, let's see. <clears throat> Damn, we Oh, it's but did we already max? Damn, we already almost maxed out his region too. All right, let's get back. Bo Adams, clutch. What the hell's Bo Adams? I also want to. You know what? Let's go unlock these uh these other characters. There. I want to. I want to get that bear. That bear looks cool.
play the DLC. What DLC? We haven't even beat the game. Uh, Blackbeard with the super chat. Thank you so much. Uh, you got me re-downloaded uh, this game. I've been playing along with you. I've uh, been going through a hard time lately with uh, the loss of friends and family. Um, uh, with a little bit of help, so much. Hey, thank you. Hey, Blackbeard, I'm glad I could be here for you. That uh, Sorry to hear that. Seriously, I, I really am. And I hope uh, things get better. That's rough, man. Would you guys say the bear is a pretty good, uh, pretty good pet or companion? Damn it, they hit the alarms. We heard the alarm! On our way to help! Shredded them. Uh, Delgico, how you doing tonight? And I do appreciate you guys. Yeah, working on already 500 likes. I really do appreciate it. Cleaned them up. Nice, nice. All right, let's hang over, head over to the Fang Center. We were supposed to also get... Uh, you know what? We said we were going to get Herc. We got to get Herc first, chat. Getting hit with the bliss? Swanny brother with the eleven months. Oh, you must be. Oh, it's all good, Swan brother. You know you don't have to worry about that, man. I appreciate you, dude. Yeah. Did you know it takes 10 days for civilization to collapse? Yeah. You take away a man's basic needs and he will revert to his primordial instinct. Of course it is, brother. 10 days. <laughs> That's a difficult thing to understand unless you've lived it. You know, I was in Iraq during the first Gulf War. 82nd Airborne All-Americans. Hoorah! 
One night there was a an ambush. The army doesn't say who uh, who uh, they say who from the unit. No Just who No radio. Nearest base, two hundred clicks to the south, so we just started walking. Well, by the third day I knew we were lost. Day six ran out of water. You know what that's like, don't you? Difficult to swallow. On the seventh day, Miller's legs started going all wonky. Did you know your brain starts to eat your muscles in order to survive? That's why you're so goddamn skinny. And by the eighth day, the wolves were closing in. And I looked at Miller and I could tell we were as good as dead. And I accepted that. And in that acceptance, came clarity. You see, I wasn't just looking at Miller. I was looking at an opportunity. And it wasn't something I wanted. It was something that I had to do. It was, it was my test. You see, Miller's sacrifice wasn't about me walking out of that desert. It was about bringing me here. The weak have their purpose. You'll understand that soon enough. the herd. David, what's up, brother? How you been, man? It's good to see you, man. He said only me, bro. He you aren't strong enough. You have to get out of here before it starts again. Follow me. Hey, Swan, you have a good rest of your day, brother. I appreciate you popping in, man. Of course. Two, three, one, two, three, 
One, two, three, one, two, three, then he's got you. It becomes second nature routine. He gets in your head. And you don't even realize it. You can't ever go back. Do you understand? You can't ever go back. Come on. Truck. That truck's gotta be there. Gotta get on that truck. It's almost done. I've studied the route for weeks. It's the only way out. You'll be safe if you don't. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. Am I going to play the DLC? Yeah, I mean, we can check it out. I was on my way to Herc. <laughs> I was on my way to Herc. Hey, Migos, it's me, Herc. Hey, Depp. Not sure where you've been, but you should head on over to the crossroads where the Grill Streak used to be. They've got something up on the screen there you've got to see. The grilled steak? My man hurt. for each other. Am I enjoying this more than Far Cry 4? Yeah, yeah, this, this is definitely uh, probably my favorite one. Have I hit a deer in real life? Oh yeah, when I was uh, I, I was a truck driver, so I hit one in my uh, tractor trailer. I've never hit one in like my personal vehicle though, um, but I, I hit one in my tractor trailer. I reacted pretty quick, um, and I didn't want to like jerk the wheel, but I also didn't want to just hit him head on. So I kind of like swerved off to the side. I was on an old back road in southern New York and um, kind of just 
gently went over to the side into the the oncoming lane and he ended up going in between my truck and trailer like where the catwalk is on a tractor trailer he went in between there and uh freaking split him in half bent my mud flap up but my truck was still good i was able to just keep going like it was like nothing happened uh but the bar that held the mud flap was like bent out bent all out of shape but How can I sleep at night? That was <laughs> I've seen a lot worse than that. <laughs> been putting those bad hombres down. I thought you'd be taller. Doesn't look like Herc or sound like him. You a registered voter? Herc State ah, Senate. Don't what? Matter. I need help of a different sort. Let's get to the point. You see that steaming pile of disappointment over there praying? That's my loin fruit, Herc Jr. Dumber than a coal bucket. He takes after his mama. Stupid some bitch went and lost my campaign truck. Nancy. I've been a yeah. I spent a lot of time in Buffalo. I had a first lady to ever serve this some routes out that way. Of course, if them Obama loving libtards find out I can't look after my own property, I can kiss this Senate run goodbye. Now, seeing as you're on my land and I didn't kill you, even though it's well within my rights as a red blooded American gun owner, I say you owe me. Help numb nuts get my truck back so I can start focusing on my campaign again. Junior, someone's here to help you. Try not to fuck it up. Herc's dad is not what I thought he would be, you know what I mean? Did he say sweet little monkey king? So if I'm leader of my own call, do I start like praying to myself then? Like prayer inception? That looks like a McDonald's hey, sandwich right there, chat. Movie. How am I supposed to get this? Ah, uh, hey man, I'm sorry. I don't want to go on assuming nobody's gender or nothing. I, I mean, I don't mean no disrespect. I just call all my homies, dude or bro or man. You know, regardless of vegetalia or penilenessness. <laughs> Whoa, deja voodoo, man. Have, have we have we met before? Dang, man, my prayers have been answered. I got a direct line to that sweet little monkey god whose heart hangs in heaven. Well, I guess since you're an angel working here on Earth, the Monkey King, that you already know I gotta get my daddy's truck back. I mean, he's real butt sore. But if we get it back, he'll let me sleep in my bed again. And I gotta tell you, man, it's getting real cold outside. Never mind them wood ticks crawling all up in my junk, threatening me with Lyme disease and whatnot. So come on, man. Help me get my daddy's truck back. Let's make dust before the old man starts shooting. He's hotter than a ghost pepper these days. So that is... A spitting image of a McDonald's sandwich here in America. A nice ride, dude. Eric's got a nice ride, chat. Shit, man, I've been praying on this all day, man. I've been asking the Monkey King, all the baby Jesuses, even the little Valentine's one. Just to send <laughs> even the little Valentine's <laughs> one. I'll tell you something though, man. Getting that truck, it ain't gonna be easy. Damn cult's got it, man. I'll be honest with you, it all started when when I tried to join them. I mean, I mean, it just seemed like a good idea. I mean, they had all these guns, food, fine-ass females, and I mean, those are three things that I'm really all about. I mean, it seemed like one big party over there. So I says, I says, hey, me, goes where do I sign up? He said, sign up right here, friend. Then, <laughs> then they start listing off all their dang rules, man. No fornicating. Turns out that means fucking. No, no alcohol and no wild out and partying, man. No thank you. 
So I got the fuck, the fuck, fuck, fuck out of there, man. Unfortunately, though, I forgot my daddy's truck. He's been real butt sore since, so I gotta get that truck. But you don't gotta worry about a thing, man. I got a nine-step plan to get in this truck, man. Step one, catch a day buzz off party liquor. Got that one covered. Step two, pray for someone else to solve my problem. Done. Step three is... Fuck did you hit? Shit. Shit, I forget the rest, but... They'll come to me as soon as, soon as we go. Let's get the Today, truck back, bro. You are a good listener, bro, but fat. Oh, man doesn't listen at all. I guess that's why I never feel hurt. Me and him, we ain't getting along that well lately. Ever since he started running for office, he's been coming down on me real hard about everything. About my public intoxication, how I handle my firearms, stuff like that, man. But when we get his truck back from them Peggy's, he's gonna be real impressed, dude. He's gonna love me so much, and then my mom's gonna have to try and love me more so she can compete with how much he loves me, and then he'll see how much she's loving me, and then he'll try and love me even more, and then birthdays and Christmases, they're gonna be off the chain. Off the chain, chat. All right, man, this is the place. Yeah, I see a lot of you guys talking about uh, copyright. There's absolutely nothing I can do about it. Uh, this shit's just built into the game. Did my man have a shotgun a beer? Like. Just like my granddaddy did in World War II with all them foreign prostitutes. You see that watchtower? Let's go fuck shit up. Winja. Winja. If you guys didn't play Far Cry Primal, the Ouija probably go like right over your head, you know? I'm gonna shot a whole rocket launcher at him, chat. Oh, yeah, man. We kicked ass. We like frozen crans and gilders turn over here. Man, I love the theater. What's up, brother? Where's your dad's truck at? I don't see it. Okay, man, now it's time for step four. The truck's actually all the way down yonder. Probably more Peggy's waiting for us, too. It's all about the zip line, man. We're going to zip line in there, sneak up on them like ninjas. Why didn't we just go down there to begin with, dude? Herc always has to do the most, champ. Yeah. 
Fuck it. <laughs> That's what stealth mode means, Chad. You just gotta say it a little quieter. This is the shit, man. It's so much fun, man. I won't come back later and do a buck naked. Feel that breeze on my tank. Girani, bro! Irk is chat in human form. I was gonna use music to control people. It'd be 80s new way. You're never the same after hearing that stuff. That's all I got to say, chat. Herc, I gotta follow you, bro, to the truck. I don't know where to go. Stop it. Well, it has to be that American-ass truck over there. With the flags and shit. You've been through worse crazy, Herc. You got this. Awesome day for living outdoors. Praise the Father. Damn, Herc, you shot that man with a whole rocket launcher. He was just standing there, bro. Shoot this guy with the rocket launcher. Shoot him. Amigo. Okay, step five. Let's move before more show up. Oh man! Oh man, we got trouble. Reach into that there cooler. See if we have any cans of whoop ass left. And pass me a beer, Chris. Jumps it. Please, Monkey King, just make this work, man. Hold on to something. We had to get those Monkey King statues in Far Cry 4. Got it. Yeah, oh my god, we pulled it off. Shit! And it was only five steps. Oh man, I I definitely forgot something, but you did good though. There it is. There it is. As long as none of this music is uh, region blocked, we'll be okay, chat. Because <laughs> if it is, the music, the stream will be blocked for you guys until it's released, which takes like a week. Daddy, Daddy, check it out, dude. Nancy's back. Would you I, look I got at her back. back. Two peas in okay. a goddamn pod. Glad she's still in one piece. Well, deputy, you kept your word. You know, I did some thinking while you were gone. This whole Senate run is too much for me to handle on my own. 
I'm in need of a campaign manager, and you're just the kind of go-getter I need to get my ass in office. First task I've got is to take Junior with you wherever you go, so I don't have to hear him praying to that <laughs> goddamn monkey king no more. Second task is, uh, well, uh, let me think on it a bit. I'll get back to you. Campaign manager chat? I don't know, not really my style. Alright, so now we you, unlocked Herc. Okay, so this looks like a this big ass Wade over at Fang Center. Peggy's took all the animals, but I think Cheeseburger is still loose. <laughs> I'm wondering if it's like Cheeseburger Eddie chat, you know what I mean? So it has, uh, the copyright has no effect on me live, which is obviously nothing. Um, so, you and Herc working together, huh? It only affects the playback it's stuff. all over the world, but doesn't seem to have learned much except how to blow things up. Uh, if he pitches any harebrained schemes involving monkeys, you do best to ignore him. All right. Let me see if we can get some uh, some good hang time here down the cheeseburger. I want to use the wingsuit. It ain't easy being yo. That was actually one of my favorite movies of all time. Like, I don't know why either. Like, you know, everybody I think has their favorite like Adam Sandler movies, but they're always like the traditional ones. Like, you know, Billy Madison and and stuff like that. Little Nicky. But honestly, The Longest Yard was like one of my favorite Adam Sandler movies of all time. Like. It was so good, chat. That's a whole tree right there. All right, this is going to kind of suck because I don't think we have enough hang time to dodge all these trees. I think we're good. Here we go. Put him to sleep, chat. I mean, Big Daddy was, I don't know, I just, I really enjoyed the longest yard. Guys, you want, you want to hear a secret? Crystal had a crush on Adam Sandler. I did. Ah! The water boy. Yo, the water boy was good too. See, I liked little Nikki. Crystal actually said she didn't like little Nikki. Yo, little Nikki, I felt like was so good. All right, let's see if I can get eyes on these, uh, on these. Alarms. I don't know how this is going to work out, though. We're going to have to do this close range. Got walls up all over the place. My name is Deputy Stacy Pratt of the Hope County Sheriff's Department. And I want, I want to apologize for the harm that I felt inflict on the people of Eaton's Gate. I never wanted any of this to happen. I was brought here under false pre pretenses and fed lies about foolishly I believe but now after this great generosity they've given me something is something is coming and if we do not prepare we will perish we will be 
answer. Shit! What? Hold on, chat. I accidentally uh clicked off screen. That's what happens when you play. It's going down, chat. Yeah, I just parachuted up a five foot drop. Madison was good. Happy Gilmore was good. I want to say Billy Madison. It was your favorite. Huh? I mean, I don't know. I, I would definitely put Happy Gilmore or Water Boy above fucking. I definitely, I definitely put Happy Gilmore or Water Boy above Billy Madison. Billy Madison, Water Boy, Water Boy because. Nah, Little Nicky. No. All those are above Billy Madison. Yeah, Water Boy is is dope, chat. Alright, so how do I get the bear, chat? I unlock oh, maybe I talked to this dude, the zookeeper dude. I'm just glad to see it out of the cult's hands, training those wolves to cause hell. Big Daddy was super dope too. Crazy wolves all the way to the old lumber mill. Keep an eye on prisoners. Now we had a bear here named Click. I like. You know, I feel like everybody sleeps on Click Chat. Part. Yo, click actually made me cry. <laughs> like I physically like was tearing and like crying. At the end there, that shit had me f actually crying, chat. Yeah, anger management. Yo, there's so many Adam Sandler, like Adam Sandler movies that were just straight slept on. I feel like Click was a big one that was slept on. Like, let's be real, chat. How many like? Let's get an F in the chat if you guys cried at the end of the click. Like, I, I I feel like you're lying if you said you did. At least got the tingly feeling. Like, maybe tears didn't actually run, but it puts you in your feelings a little bit. Like, let F in the chat if, if if click had you A, crying, or at least with the, you know, that little tingly sensation where you're like, damn, man, you know. You didn't see it? Yo, I'm telling you. 
<laughs> the tingly feel. I'm telling you, it will definitely get. It will definitely get you. You never seen Click, man. You guys gotta watch Click. It's pretty. It's pretty dope. It's uh, Adam Sandler gets like this uh, remote that he can like control time. He can fast forward shit and stuff like that. And um, it, it's funny as hell. And uh, yeah, but it's 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 pretty good. It's pretty good. He gets it from what Bed Bath and Beyond from the Beyond section. <laughs> um, it's it's pretty good. So. Uh trying to say had a soft spot for chad's barbecue but he got the diabetes so we put him on a liquid salmon diet anywho cult tried to take him so i set him free last i heard he was causing all sorts of mayhem someone should go find him make sure he's all right grab some salmon from the pond ahead of time though then feed cheeseburger that salmon and he'll be eating out of the palm of your hand hey i'm all about that chat we gotta grab some salmon for a fishing mission That's some sandbags. That's all good. So where's this fishing spot? Let's go do some fishing, chat. Yeah, click was a definite banger, chat. Definite banger. Like, if you haven't watched Click, definitely give it a. And you like Adam Sandler movies, give it, give it a shot. You should enjoy it. Ooh. Dude, not gonna let me fish though. I'm the only thing I'm worried about these damn random ass helicopter or planes. Ooh, it's a nice fishing spot, chat. Yeah? A lot of ammo. Look who's putting on the moves, Sam. I mean, they're they're dog fighting up there. We should be okay. Let's get us some salmon. Adam. Visuals on target. Don't do it, bro. I'm fishing. Uh, do I play GTA 5? No. Um, I've never played it on the channel. I played it. Got him. I played it, um, you know, before, just never on my channel. I 
did think about playing. Um, we talked about it before with our when we were playing Red Dead Redemption Two about playing Red Dead Online. There we go. There we go. How many do we need for the mission? Hey, if you got that salmon, I just heard cheeseburger was spotted at Lanero Building Supplies. Too far from here. Can we take the river up? We can. And this boat has been kindly donated to us by the enemy I like really enjoyed the story of GTA 5 like the actual campaign absolutely blown away and then loved it like it was awesome um but, yeah, I never really invested much into the, uh, like, played the online. Hmm, not going that way. For the obvious waterfall reason. Damn! I hate when rocks and like games glitch out and the rocks just teleport in front of you. Shit's crazy, Jet. Happens to me all the time. No matter what I'm driving, trees and rocks and people, shit just get in front of me. Crazy guy. But it only seems to happen to me. It's like, it's like a bug that I only experience. So it's hard for, you know, you guys to really understand where I'm coming from. Trust me, the bear is the least of your worries. Damn it.
Quinja. They just kicked the shit out the bear, dude. even do anything chat I mean neither did I but still you know you would think in the mission where they introduced the bear the bear would go ham The diabetes. He's got the diabetes, chat. Oh, Herc's dad actually has another mission for us. I actually need. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to We got to go restock really quick, chat. We have nothing. Whole lots of nothing. Call him, we're gonna call him Bear, bro. There we go. I had to restock. The M60 would probably be a, a really good option for the planes, honestly. Even the helos. Might switch from the RPG to an M60. That's a good call. Well, look here. It's my new campaign manager. Got a new job for you. Do you know what gerrymandering is? Of course you don't. You're a regular American, just like me. It's boring egghead stuff involving redrawn voting districts, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, 
the election's coming up, and them eggheads tell me I'm fucked in the polls because those goddamn peggies ain't gonna be voting for me. Say what you will about lunatic cult movements, but the bottom line is, they vote. Now, the eggheads say the only chance I got at winning would be to go back in time and gerrymander them district lines so the peggies ain't counted. And that got me to thinking, I could just as easily win if them peggies just didn't show up to vote. Now, I'm not telling you how to go about such a thing, wink, wink, but... A permanent solution to my temporary problem would work best, if you catch my meaning. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not saying to murder anyone, because that's still illegal. It is still technically illegal, right? But if there were less Peggy's around, because they somehow tripped and fell on several dozens of bullets, it would probably help my chances. I'm using that one from now on, champ. Tripped and fell on some bullets. No, I didn't shoot it. Diner. You can take my idiot son with you. He's not good at much, but he can shoot okay. And you know, if this were ever to blow back on us, it would be good to have Patsy. I don't even think he'd get jail time on account of him being a little touched. Well, what you waiting for? Get moving. A little touched. Make hope great again. Let's do it. These damn airplanes are literally everywhere. Hey, Rachel, good night. Thank you for hanging out. Precision chat. Get out. Get out, bro. What's up? Well, you can't just run up on me like that, bro. Like this, like... Fucking true. You really try to steal my car out of what do you mean innocent? Chat, dude. There's no way. This dude just tried to fucking commit grand theft auto on my car. And he was innocent? Get out of here, chat. He escape. I don't care if he's escaping from danger. He doesn't need to take my fucking car. The 
say his car. I took the, this was Herc's car. I took this from Herc's farm, chat. I've been driving this car the whole time. Uh-uh, no, 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 no. This car wasn't just random. Okay, listen, listen, listen. If this car was randomly in the road, I would be like, yeah, okay, I, I get it, chat. You know, it was might have been. I drove this car here, okay? Mine. <laughs> I'm the campaign manager. Look at the little American thing, like the little American star. Campaign manager's car. I mean, if Herc stole it, that's not my fault. Oh, damn, the bear got down. Oh, somehow I gotta help him out. He's just taking a little nap. Canadians ever do to anybody.
You and I are damn sure gonna make Montana great again. Tell you what, how about you take old Nancy? You go around cleaning up this county in that truck, and all them prospective voters will know who's got their backs. Oh, and please don't bring her junior back. Ever. Damn. So much copyright in this episode, it's hopeless, Sam. It's about a 40% chance this video is getting blocked. Only... Don't worry, you'll be out of here soon enough. Did you think you were free? Thank you guys. Already working on 600 likes on the stream. I really appreciate you. Went to a whole lot of trouble for nothing. That's okay. He knows better now. I told you you're not a hero. You are a tool. You know your purpose. What happens if you don't do it, chat? I'm wondering. Like, what happens if you fail? Because now I'm scared that he's sent... He, like, this is going to be me actually killing all of the people. Cool. Watch your time. No!
I knew it, chat. I fucking knew it, man. Only you could make this world seem right. Only you could make the darkness right. Only you. <laughs> hey, only you could have gotten this close. Only you could have earned his trust. It was always only ever you. Good work. You did it. You passed your test. You made your sacrifice. But now, you're alone. And you're weak. And we know what happens to the weak. I call her. It's what I do. I'll be outside waiting for you. Eli! No! no. What the fuck did you do? You fucking killed him! Wait! You fucking beat of shit! Weedy! You fucked the two! Weedy! I fucked the two! Wait! Weedy! It was Jacob! No! Listen to me. It was Jacob. We've seen this before. Ronnie, Parker, this is what he does. And we let him write it. You find that motherfucker. You find Jacob. Or next time I see you, so help me God, I'll kill you myself. Yo, is there a way to not kill that dude? Let's say you get out of this. What's next? You go back to running errands for a teenager and a housewife? The White Tails are nothing without Eli. You are nothing without Eli. You're tougher than I thought. But killing me won't change a goddamn thing. You think I give a shit if I die? That's my purpose. I give my life for Joseph's. And I do it gladly. I understand my role. I am his sacrifice. Simple as that. You are meat. Again. Good, huh? 
Don't you find it ironic that everyone you try to help wind up worse off? Eli, Pratt, tragedy just follows you. If you really wanted to keep people safe, be a hero. You just off yourself. Safer for everyone that way. to the weak. You can't stop fate. Dropped them. Temporarily dropped them.
Got him. Well, my brother saw all this coming. I don't know if he talks to God. That doesn't matter. He was right. Humanity is once again in crisis. It doesn't matter. Chief, we will always find a way <laughs> to break it down. Babylon, Rome, empires rise, <laughs> empires fall. America, <sighs> we're no different. We think we're indestructible. World War II, war on terror. Survived it, but it only brought us closer to the edge. And this is where we are, right here on schedule, just waiting for someone to push us. And oh boy, if you pushed us, <laughs> you did everything he said you would do. And you didn't even know it. Jacob's rifle. I don't know if thank you is the right thing to say, but... Well, Eli's death won't be in vain now. I'm sorry about what's happened, truly. You ain't the only one to blame, but... Now ain't the time to mourn or point fingers. That deputy Pratt of yours and a whole bunch of our white tails are wasting away in Jacob's armory. Get moving. We're counting on you. We will save them, chat. That's what we do. I'm a savior. Where are they located? Deputy, you might want to pop in a nearby shop and check out some new gear. Uh, actually, I want to rearm my ammo. <laughs> Shit! Like I handled that like a boss, chat. You know what I mean? Oh, why would they spawn me up on top of it like that? Down there. Really, really. Wanted to check out this, that guy's sniper rifle and see how it was. 
feels any better than the one we currently have. I, th I feel like it's the same one. Hey. Some people think Eli's a bit rough around the edges. Not me. He's never steered us wrong. I'd follow him to hell and back. I bet he's dead. Too bad he didn't make it, unfortunately. Okay, so we have... This. Nine, nine... Yeah, ours is what? Nine, nine... Ten, five, two. Nine, nine, ten, five, two. Right, chat? This is... Eight, nine. Yeah, so the one we have is better. All right, hold on one sec, guys. Yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna swap to his rifle because it looked really cool, but ours, ours is just all around better. And I want to thank everybody in chat again. Over six hundred likes on the stream. I really do appreciate it. All right, let's go rescue these civvies. I'm gonna hop in the chopper. I mean, even though I could actually just get in this pickup truck right here or van. Why do they call the van a pickup? We'll just drive up there. Brian wearing pants confirmed. Yeah, it, it's it's too cold in my house, at least. Uh, to not be wearing pants, unfortunately. I live in upstate New York, and it's cold here, chat. <laughs> really, really cold. The crazy thing is, Tim... Timmy, uh, Tim, I don't know if you guys know the streamer, Tim the Tap Man. Uh, he's from upstate New York, too, and, uh... He wears ranger panties. I don't even think Tim served in the in the military. That's why it's funny when I see him wear Ranger panties. I don't know. He might have. I don't know. Does anybody know if Timmy served in the military? But he wears Ranger panties. And, uh... He's from upstate New York. But, obviously, Timmy's got money. So, he probably... He's probably got some nice heat going on in his house. Or at least in his office. Yeah, we're getting a lot of snow. My kids actually got let out of... Uh, school early. Saving people, chat. Saving people. What are Ranger panties? Um, I don't know if you guys ever seen people in the uh, Army Marine Corps, but they're the PT shorts. They're really, really, really small. Uh, that's what we call ranger panties. I've wore I've worn my fair share of ranger panties. They make they make you run faster, Chas. It, it's actual science. Like it, I'm just saying, it's actual science. And anybody else has served in the military, you guys know ranger panties are it's science. They make you run faster. 
I don't make this shit up, chat. I'm telling you, Chad, Google Ranger panties right now. Google them and you'll 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 understand. Them shits add at least like say say you run like a say you run a thirteen thirty two like two mile, right? Or like a like a nineteen minute three mile. Throw on a throw on a pair of ranger panties easily. Sub twelve like sub twelve thirty chat. You're taking an easy minute off your runtime just by swapping the Ranger panties. An easy minute. Therefore, you must prepare for what comes next. Because the ones who were left behind are coming. The desperate, the selfish, the sinner. I'm pretty sure, like, like I, Hussein Bolt wore, wore Ranger panties. I'm pretty sure they all wear Ranger panties in the Olympics and stuff. Bonus me to shave your legs. <laughs> I, I messed up once in my life, chat. Little little TMI for you guys. But uh, when I was stationed in Hawaii, right before I deployed to Iraq, I was I was in K Bay, Kanae Bay, Hawaii. And uh, we were there for like a month and a half before we actually left, because uh, the unit I was deploying that uh, Iraq with was that—that's where they were from, two three infantry battalion. Um, so I was uh, I was in the barracks, and we were about to go down to um, Waikiki, bunch of beaches and stuff like that. And I don't know why, but like one of my boys that I was hanging out with just got me so insecure about my I had like the little the soul patch thing or what is it called chat the 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 little hair that runs up the middle of your stomach and then I had like a just like a couple pieces right here but what is it called you know the 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 line of hair that that runs up your uh your stomach there what is the what is the name of it there's like I, I, I I know there's a name up for it, right? Yeah, well, come on. I'm not I'm not losing my mind. Or is it just Land No, it's not a landing strip. <laughs> <laughs> the treasure trail, the snail trail. Well, I had one of those. You know what I mean? And it was just like it was just going up and then I had like a couple pieces on my chest. So, um I was like, man, you know, we're going out to these beaches. I want to shave it off. I want to, like, you know, I just want it to be nice. Happy trail, the happy trail. That's what it is. Yeah, the happy trail. So I was like, I'm going to shave my, 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 my stomach. I'm going to shave my chest. I'm going to go down to these beaches. I'm going to be nice and smooth. You know what I mean? So uh, I shaved with a big ch chat with a razor. All right. And I swear, chat, I ruined my body. Like that day ruined my actual body. I went from that. And then when it came back, chat, I, I I just I transformed into this hairy beast, and now I have hair everywhere, chat, everywhere. Like I'm a beast. I went from having my little happy trail and a couple pieces right here to just being an actual werewolf, man. Yeah. So I'm telling you right now, if you're young and you got the happy trail, don't shave it. Just leave it. <laughs> You get one chance, and if you fuck it up, you ruin your body for life. There it is, chat. There's, that, that's Brian Menard's story on what happened to my hap. Yeah. It's too late. Yeah, it's, it's, you get one chance, chat. You get one chance, and that's it. They don't, they, that's shit they should teach in school. That shit they need to teach in health class. You know what I mean? Like, that's. That's ridiculous. Like, that's stuff people in life need to know. But, yeah, let's not teach them about that. Let's teach them about fucking calculus and all this chemistry shit that they'll never use. No, don't teach them the fucking fact that if you don't, if you shave off your goddamn happy trail, you're going to turn into a damn werewolf. 
I feel like that's life lessons, chat. I, I should open up my own school and people will be squared away. Yeah, never shave that shit. Just leave it. Yeah, I'm telling you, science. I'm not making it up, chat. It's science. Okay, I think I figured it out. Looks like they keep their prisoners all the way at the bottom of that bunker. If you're going to rescue Pratt, you'll need to start at the control room. Whole place is probably on lockdown by now, but if you head there, you should be able to undo that with Jacob's key. Good luck. Damn, yeah, Chad, they're so violent. May the Father of Understanding guide us. Now you're gonna die. Yeah, Chad, that, that's my. I'm telling you, if you if you don't like your body hair, and you're young, just leave it. I promise you, it's gonna. It, it, it can always be worse. It can always get worse. Just leave those little peach fuzzes. Just leave it. Because it's, it's a lot better than the alternative, chat. I mean, I've embraced my body hair now. You know, it's my, it's my bulletproof vest. That shit's that thick. I didn't even I didn't even have to use e sappy plates when I was in Afghanistan. Yeah, I had body hair. That's the armor of the gods. <laughs> Lockdown initiated. Pressure door sealed. No, you don't. I know you would. If, if I was a nice, silky, smooth man. Now, what Pressure is the worst thing you could ever be? Hmm? No, it's not. It's not weak. All right, listen, listen, Priscilla, I get what you're saying. Chat, listen, listen, listen. You know, people are like, oh, body hair on men, you know, hearts or body hair on men. That's a real man. There's a difference. All right. There's there's having body hair on men and then there's having a little bit of man on your body hair. And that's what I am. OK, so there's body hair on man. And then it's just having a little bit of man sprinkled on your body hair. And uh, it's different. It's, it's definitely different, chat. <laughs> oh, man. Traitorous. Treasonous. Ungrateful for the mercy that we have shown you. It's facts, it's science. I'm just saying. It's the worst thing you could ever be. Joseph, make sure we get the best weapons.
Only you can prevent forest fires. <laughs> oh, oh my god, I didn't think it was actually going to say only you, dude. Chat, what are the chances? See chat. Not me, man. I'm all about I'm all about keeping dogs alive. All this water in here, man. You shouldn't be messing around with the electricity, bro. I'm gonna be real with you guys, chat. The way that room is set up. The way that room is set up. Um, never do something like that because you would 100% get hit by a ricochet. 100% bullets would be ricocheting all over that damn place. Me and him would have been dead. Give me up, dude. Give me up. Evacuate. 
Ooh, thank you. Well, I should have tried the armor piercing him. Man, I always forget that shit, dude. Alright, where you at, bro? So were Joseph, uh, Jacob, and John, or were they actual brothers? Or did he just kind of like recruit some people together and call them brothers? Okay, so they, uh, that's what I... Each of us found the white tail in our own ways. But what brought us here? was lost. Families. Friends. Eli gave us back a little piece of that. He showed us the only thing we can rely on is each other. He was my friend. And I'm gonna miss him. It wasn't you, Eli knows that. Eli thought if we could just hang on, wait it out, Eden's Gate would just go away. But they won't. Fuck, no, they won't. Cancer doesn't fade, it grows. It spreads. You have to cut it out. Yeah. These fucking Peggy's believe the end of the world is yeah. coming. Yeah. It is for them. Eden's gate ends today. Those, we won't stop until every last one of those motherfuckers yeah. is yes. taken from these trees. Another seal has been opened. My family, my brothers, my sisters, they've been taken from me by a snake in the garden. Hey man, I got all the boogies coming out, Chad. As you know, he's really... And he snorted them back up like a champion. I thought I knew God's plan. <laughs> But I was wrong. I was blind. <laughs> but now I see. You took my family from me so that I could have yours. We will welcome them with open arms. Just as we will welcome you. We will be waiting for you. Where it all began. A little rock with lots of sand. 
I need a life to give me more. To lead a life that is hardcore. One, two, three, four. Like, that takes straight skill, chat. Like, for them boogies to just drop down that far and for you to snort them shits right back up. That's next level. No wonder why he's the leader. Listen up, deputy. I'm thinking we've reached the end of the line. Time to cowboy up and deal with Joseph Seed once and for all. He's waiting for you at his church. Where it all began. Where the hell is that church? Chizzy chat. Where is the church? Mm, there it is. Right, let me uh, restock though. Need a word. Got body armor. And yes, I will be playing Fall, Fall Cry New Far Cry New Dawn. We will be playing New Dawn before going into six. Am I finished the game to stream? I mean, how how much longer is the game? Because we still got. How much longer do you guys think we have left before we beat the, the end boss? Oh, this is that. Yeah, then we'll finish it. Yeah, we'll finish the main story. Let's do it. I didn't know if this was actually the last mission or. Uh Now, the thing is, is, like, the main mission's a decent length, you know what I mean? About, about the same as any other Far Cry game. Um, but there is, don't don't sit here and think, like, the game is short by any means. Like, there's tons of content. Like, if you want to 100% this game, you'll easily, you could easily put, like, 50, 60 hours into this game if you wanted to completely do everything. Ah, oh, Jay, but I'm glad you enjoyed. Yo, Red Dead Redemption Two was a was a great time. We talked about doing another playthrough of it, but like only like playing super super savage uh but i think before i would play uh another playthrough of the story i would i would try i i, I do want to try red dead online at some point incognito how you doing with the 18 months thank you so much was the sister easy? i would honestly say the sisters region was the hardest region out of all of them. Come on. 
when the Lamb broke the fifth seal, I saw under the altar the souls of the martyrs, slain because of the word of God. You made martyrs of my family. And I am prepared to do the same to yours. What? But God is watching us. And he will judge us on what we choose in this moment. That man got juice like that, we chat? That we were living in a world on the brink. Where every slight, every injustice, where every choice reveals our sins. And where have those sins led us? Where have those sins led you? Your friends have been taken and tortured. And it's your fault. Countless people have been killed and it is your fault. The world is on fire and it's yours. Was it worth it? Was it? When are you going to realize that every problem cannot be solved with a bullet? When you first came here, I gave you the choice to walk away. You chose not to. In the face of God, I'm making you that offer one last time. You put down your guns and you take your friends. You leave me my flock. And you go in peace. Go in peace. You're fucking insane. Is he? We never should have been here in the first place. You know what to do, Rook. Remember. God is watching. Damn, chap. Judge not, and you will not be judged. Condemn not, and you will not be condemned. Forgive. And you will be forgiven. Take your friends, my child, and go. Is he actually going to not kill him, though? Brooke, let's go. What? What are you doing? Get in the truck. I'm not leaving. Hudson, get in the truck. You lost your fucking mind. Get in the goddamn truck! Sometimes it's best to just leave well enough alone. This man got juice. <laughs> Let's go. This man got juice. But we should have came here in the first place, chat. <laughs> Sir. 
sir. With all due respect. What the fuck? We can't just leave those people. We're not gonna leave those people. We're going to Missoula. We're gonna get the National Guard and we're gonna bring the hammer down on that. Yeah, I like that plan, no, bro. No way. I'm not gonna be a part of this. You heard what he said. You're gonna do exactly as you're told, Pratt. What's wrong? Wait, what happened? Did the song play and did I kill them all? Was it still brainwashed chat? Only you. See, I thought if I left, I would have saved their lives. You know what I mean? And, uh... Well, we've already played Far Cry Primal on the channel. Oh shit. So you can't even continue the game unless you unless you make the other choice, chat. Yeah, that, that that choice I made doesn't even allow you to continue playing the game. I didn't even have to reload. It, it's it's mandatory. Slain because of the word of God. You made martyrs of my family. And I am prepared to do the same to yours. But God is watching us. And he will judge us on what we choose in this moment. Does this I man not own a shirt? Living in a world on the brink. For every slight. Every injustice. Where every choice reveals our sins. And where have those sins led us? Where have those sins led you? Your friends have been taken and tortured. And it's your fault. Countless people have been killed and it is your fault. The world is on fire and it's your fault. Was it worth it? Was it? When are you going to realize that every problem cannot be solved with a bullet? 
when you first came here. I gave you the choice to walk away. You chose not to. In the face of God, I'm making you that offer one last time. You put down your guns. And you take your friends. You leave me my flock. And you go in peace. Go in peace. You're fucking insane. Is he? We never should have been here in the first place. You know what to do, Rook. I mean, this motherfucker did kill his baby chap. Remember. God is watching. Yeah, God is watching. Every slight. Every injustice. And every choice reveals our sin. John was wrong. Your sin is not wrath. So you'd rather watch the world suffer and burn than swallow your pride. And the Lamb broke the sixth seal, and lo, there was a great earthquake. And the sun became black, and the moon's under blood. the truth. They welcome Eden's gate into their hearts. They will die for me. Oh, what the fuck am I stuck on, Jet? You can't go there. I, yeah, you got. You're super limited. I was trying to not shoot them. I revived her and she's on my side. Get him? That was crazy. I don't think it's over yet. Keep on your toes, I gave you every chance, and you threw it all away. You brought the world crashing down around us. Don't you see that? You will feel the full fury of the Lord. Damn, that lady just shot the shit out of me, dude. Of 
Together, we are one. That was weird. Your we got it wrong, man. Now stand it for the storm. This is totally fucking crazy. Everything back. you've done, everything you've earned, everything you fought for is for nothing! Got to do one, kill him, do one, kill him, do one, kill him. Seventh seal. There was silence in heaven. And the seven angels before God were given seven trumpets. 
And there were noises. Thunderings, lightnings. And an earthquake. Joseph Seed, you're under arrest. And I heard a great voice from the temple say to the angels, Go your ways and pour from the vials the wrath of God upon the earth. Is that a fucking nuke? It is finished, child. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sing great. Move, Shockwave is coming, bro. Yo, was this crazy ass dude right the whole time? Not with me driving, I'm a boss. Another one, bro. A lot of nukes hitting Montana, chat. There's a lot of nukes hitting Montana. I didn't know it was such a prime target. I think IRL, Montana probably wouldn't get a single nuke. This means it means the politicians have been silenced. It means the corporations have been erased. It means the world has been cleansed by God's righteous fire. Right. 
You were, bro. I'll give you the dubs. The collapse has come. The world as we know it is over. I waited so long. I waited so long for the prophecy that God whispered in my ear to be fulfilled. I prepared my family for this moment. And you took them from me. I should kill you for what you've done. But you're all I have left now. You're my family. And when the world is ready to be born anew, we will step into the light. I am your father. And you are my child. And together we will march through Eden's gate. You guys said that leads into Far Cry New Dawn. So was New Dawn a DLC or was it an actual game? Kind of both. The map for New Dawn is the same as Far Cry 5. Is it changed any, though? Like, did they alter the way it looks? There's, I mean, after all them damn nukes, it should look like goddamn Fallout. <laughs> you know what I mean? I didn't, you know, Montana was a prime target in the nuclear apocalypse. <laughs> we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to definitely look into jump. Uh, we're, I'm, I'm excited, actually. Uh, yeah, we're, we'll, we'll, yeah, we're gonna do New Dawn. Because it's a, like you guys said, a direct, um, that, and I, I already bought the game, so we're going to at least play it. Um, but yeah, I, so I see some people saying that this game had a Vietnam DLC. How do you access that? Let me see real quick. Is it in the... What is this? Dead lifting some by hours of darkness. Oh, I don't own the DLC. Gotcha, chat. Okay, so I don't have the DLC for this game. Chat, what is dead living zombies? Played the Vietnam map. It was fun. So we're going to do another... We are going to do another Far Cry 5 stream. Um, 
before moving on to New Dawn. I might check out all three of the DLCs, and I even might dip my toes into the uh, arcade because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't check out the arcade at all. So I might check out the arcade mode. Uh, can you access arcade? Yeah, you can access arcade right from the main menu here. Oops. All right, my bad. Um Bounty Hunt. What the fuck? I don't know. Don't even know what's happening right now, chat. Fuck am I supposed to kill chat? Everybody's catching bullets right now. What is even happening? I don't I don't even know what's happening right now. I have no fucking clue what the hell this is, chat. No clue, dude. It was very green, and I was just shooting every person I seen. There it is. Um, but next episode, I, I will look into getting those DLCs, chat, and then um, we'll check out the three DLCs, and then from that point, um, we'll, we'll we'll move on to Far Cry New Dawn. I have no fucking clue what the hell that was, chat. None whatsoever. Um, but there it is, chat. We're going to end this stream tonight. Uh, we'll be doing some more streams tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll see a bunch of you guys over there. We'll be, uh, I know for a fact we're playing Assassin's Creed and uh, the second game. Uh, I know we got to we gotta get ready, chat. Dead, uh, Dead Space Remake comes out here in a few days. I'm really, really excited for that. So, hopefully, you guys are uh, ready for that on the channel. Because, yeah, we're going to be playing Dead Space Remake here soon. 
But uh, thank you guys for hanging out today. I really do appreciate over 700 likes on the stream. I appreciate the support. Um, if you guys haven't, hey, smash that like button on your way out. If you guys are enjoying the content, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. And uh, other than that, chat, I love you all. Thank you so much. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.